a moment and go to the New Testament, to the book of Jude, the smallest book in the Bible, full of so many nutrients and amazing content. And in verse 20, Jude starts with this, this passage and he says, but you dear friends, by building yourselves up in your most holy faith and praying in the Holy Spirit, uh, keep yourselves in God's love as you wait for the mercy of the Lord Jesus Christ to bring you to eternal life. There's so much happening in this passage and back in verse 17, it starts with this call to persevere. Life's hard. In case you haven't gotten that memo recently, the struggle bus is real and the tickets are unlimited. There's no limited seating on the struggle bus and there's a spot for everybody every day. And we all have different insecurities and struggles that take over our mind that we look in the eye when we look in the mirror each day. But the reality is, I love this passage where he says, but build yourselves up in the most holy faith. Everything else fades away at the end of the day. Everything else is dust like in the movie Endgame and it's just going to disappear. But your faith and the Lord is not going anywhere. He is the best foundation we can ever have. He is the best nutrients and filling we can ever experience. He is your light. He is the way. He is the truth. He's the life. He is everything he claims to be. Not halfway, not 90%, not almost 100%. He is there all the time and he's there for you. How do you build yourself up in the most holy faith? You saturate. If you've ever taken a sponge and put it into water, it takes a moment, like a truly all the way dry, shriveled up hard sponge, and you put it in water, it's not instant. It takes a few seconds for the water to move throughout the sponge, to change the coarseness to a softness for the sponge to absorb. But once it does, it doesn't go back to being all the way dry till you leave it out for a very long time. You continue to put it in the water, put it in the water, and it becomes more and more useful, more and more full of water, more and more full of soap, more and more useful. When you saturate yourself in the presence of God, when you saturate yourself with worship, God's word, and you surround yourselves with other believers that are iron sharpening iron, and they're going to pour the presence of the Lord over you. They're going to speak life over you. When you make God non-negotiable in your life is when you begin to build yourself up in your holy faith. And when you build yourself up in your holy faith, everything else looks different. Jude lays it out right here, and he gives us this amazing one step at a time, one day at a time, praying in the Holy Spirit and building yourself up in the most holy faith and your perspective, your life will look so much different because God never changes and he's not going anywhere.